Leaders with the Columbus City School District say these are the six candidates they will interview for the role of superintendent for the state's largest district. The number was reached after receiving 31 applications for that position. We thank you for joining us today for NBC 4 at 5. I'm Jared Smalley. And I'm Jennifer Bullock. The candidates come from various regions across the country and include the district's own interim superintendent. NBC 4 Sierra Johnson joins us now. You've had a chance to really review these resumes, so what can you tell us? Yeah, I can tell you that the search began about a month ago and it brings us to where we are now. Uh, this comes after a six hour long school board meeting last night. And as you see, those finalists have been named. Those selected represent various regions and bring diverse educational experiences. And for parents in the district, they tell me they are hoping the next leader understands the complexities of the district and has a plan for the future. Ultimately, you want to have a say in your child's education. Nicole Friday is the parent of a first grader in the Columbus City School District. This is her first year as a CCS parent, and we met her at the beginning of the year as she and her son Aiden navigated virtual learning during the CCS teacher strike. She says her son has thrived at his elementary school, and she's kept a close eye on the search for a new superintendent. They sent out a survey a couple weeks ago, in which we got to input data on what we thought were key leadership act or key aspects a, a superintendent should have. So I was able to participate in that and they constantly sent emails about where they were and ways in which we could be involved, which I thought was really good. She, like thousands of others, looked on as the district released the names, bios and photos of these six candidates selected to take part in interviews. Dr. Thomas Ahart, he's superintendent of Des Moines Public Schools. Dr. Angela Chapman was recently appointed interim superintendent and CEO of Columbus City Schools. Dr. Jermaine Dawson is chief academic and accountability officer for Birmingham Public Schools. Dr. Stephanie Jones serves as chief officer for the Office of Diverse Learner Supports and Services with Chicago Public Schools. Dr. Brian McDonald is superintendent of the Pasadena Unified School District and Dr. George Eric Thomas is the associate superintendent for Minneapolis Public Schools. Also hope they understand the uniqueness of uh, Columbus. I saw that some of the people are coming from outside of Columbus. So I hope they take the time to really learn our city and what makes our city unique. <laughs> So the big question for a lot of folks, what happens from here? According to district communication, interviews with the candidates will take place today and Thursday. The district says final interviews will be held in two weeks. Jennifer. All right, Sierra, thank you. And the board will invite final candidates to visit Columbus for a day in the district. That's Thursday, May 11th. As part of the day in the district, the district will host a meet the candidates community forum where members of the community can hear from the finalists in a moderated question and answer format.